Apple's first product was the Apple One, which was sold as an assembled circuit board and lacked basic features such as a keyboard, monitor, and case in July 1976. It did have some notable features, however, including the use of a TV display, whereas many machines had no display at all. About 200 units were eventually sold. But it wasn't until the release of the Apple II in 1977 that truly put Apple on the map. Almost as soon as Apple had started selling its first computers, Wozniak moved on from the Apple One and began designing the next generation product based on his belief that a personal computer should be small, reliable, convenient to use, and inexpensive. The Apple II went on sale on June 10, 1977 with a retail price $1,298. Yeah, the computer provided a completely redesigned TV interface, which held the display in memory. Now, not only useful for the simple text display, it included graphics and color, and went on to sell about 6 million units in 